And, uh, I'm here with a video upload to talk about airbending and uh, how I believe that airbending is uh, the first thing that we should all master and get to know before attempting doing a regular telekinesis in a dead still room. And the way, the reason why I say that is because um, when you're when you're working with ambient energy flowing around you, um, whether it's like an air conditioner in the room with the soft gusts flowing around, or outside with the wind kind of you know a little bit blowing a little bit, you can connect with objects like 80 to 90 percent more easier and more faster, and get faster results. And what that does is that it builds belief in you that telekinesis, psychonesis is real. And it builds confidence for you to sustain and stay in your development of psychokinesis abilities. And what I mean psychokinesis is it, it's an umbrella that houses under all of the telekinesis, psychokinesis abilities. Umbrella abilities, you know, um, um, the other abilities, you know, like manipulating clouds and all the other ones, you know, um, like hydro, you know, water, things like that. And uh, aerokinesis is like... The, the holy grail of, uh, of what I believe of the of, of all the abilities that will the, basically the gateway ability that will lead to to allow you to master the other abilities because it builds confidence again and belief and you get faster results and you connect with the object faster it's a real strange thing but uh, air, uh, ambient energy does that it helps you a lot to connect with things faster and quicker and um, you've probably seen um, for all novices, and for even intermediate and advanced, I recommend novices who want to do telekinesis or any psychokinesis ability, go directly straight start first with airbending. You know, do airbending first, and uh, uh, I think it's uh, hydro, uh, um, aerokinesis or whatever it is, I guess it's called that, I forget. But uh, work with things outside, you know. Um, you see a lot of videos, you, know, you, see, you see Trevor Center working with the... Uh, you know, outside in the grass, you know, with the spinning that little propeller thing that he's kind of like in the distance spinning that thing. Your son is suffering from a oh. mental illness. Um, with the air flowing, and uh, you saw him with that stick and where he has a little clock kind of flowing and directing it and moving it. Oh, all we can do is just pray to God and have faith. <sighs> like a perfect place to start because you know you you get faster results you believe that you're you're gaining control that's the main thing you, your belief is building and getting stronger because you're realizing and 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 you're believing that you are uh, sustaining and getting control of the object you know and um, you have to you know like I say you have to start first with yourself you know, you have to uh, prove to yourself first that first that all this stuff, all this crazy telekinesis, psychokinesis stuff is real, and then you can then show it off to other people. But you have to prove it to yourself first that it's real. And once you have that cemented and down, down packed down, then it's it's just you know your confidence and your skills is going to develop upward. But it all depends if you're dedicated and. Um, take this seriously. You have to take it seriously. You have to take telekinesis seriously and you have to be completely involved emotionally and physically involved in what you're doing. Just like ba playing baseball or basketball. You know, if you want to be the best at it, you have to, you know, be engaged and enthusiastic about what you're doing. And you see people outside uh, messing with the, the leaves outside, you know, spinning tornadoes and leaves. That's all aerokinesis. You know, and, uh, air, uh, aerokinesis, airbending, you're not to start with airbending, man. Start first with that. And for intermediate and advanced, um, they probably already know, Trevor Seven already knows. But uh, um, go back to it so that you can further develop your skill, cement your confidence and your power and your will, and uh, you know, and um, just uh, sharpen your skill and your telekinesis, psychonesis abilities. And uh, uh, you know, uh, it's basically it's a gateway ability. The reason why it's a gateway ability is because it builds confidence and belief. Then when you when you get a, a, a gist of how you get control, when, you, when you're able to uh, control a spinning uh, little propeller thing like Trevor Seven does, or the little stick with the 
cloth flowing around. Once you have control of doing controlling things outside with the air outside or inside or whatever, um, then you can come back inside and work and work from the bottom up again. But now you have a better set mindset of confidence and belief. Work from the bottom up again, but the dead still room and start uh, working on, on CSI wheel and and build that confidence up again. It's gonna be it's gonna take time. You have top lot patience. You have to be involved. But air kinesis, air bending is the way to go. Like it's like the, the holy grail of the gate opener to all the ability because it's gonna uh, enlighten you and build belief in you and confidence. So uh, air bending man, start with that. That's the first thing, you know. Uh, don't get frustrated by starting in a dead steel room trying to move things to objects. Maybe some people will have the ability to do that. But air bending and aerial kinesis work with that first. And you know, like then you know, because uh, because we can't all be Nina uh, Nina Caligula or, or the Chinese man that you see in the video, you know, pushing that blue bowl back and forth on the table. I mean, Nina Caligula is like a Michael Jordan, you know, and the, the Chinese man is like the Kobe Bryant or something, you know. You know, they're like it's amazing what they do. But we can all reach that level. We can. We have to be dedicated. And we have to stick to it. Eric Kinesis, stick with it and do. It's Rick Sisbitt, and think I watch.